dude. I'm so excited. For a prom? Yeah, I hope there's I hope there's tons more drinks. Yeah, I think you've had enough, don't you think? No, I don't think so. There's been one confirmed vitality, four injuries, and one arrest for DUI. biggest concerns is your safety, especially around this time of year. So that's a, a big part of why we do this, so that you have a visual reminder of why we encourage you to make such uh, good choices moving forward, so that you don't put yourself or others in this kind of situation. You know, some of y'all during this prom season will drink, okay? I know that, you know that. All I ask of you is whatever you do, do not drive the car or anything else, four-wheelers or whatever. And don't ride in a car with somebody that's impaired. Real simple. Some of this stuff, you know, when you start thinking about it and you start looking at all this, some of it breaks your heart. Because a lot of these first responders have been to things like this where children 16, 17 years old have, have passed away and, and gone on. They're just a statistic. According to the Governor's Office of Highway Safety, in 2016, there was 272 alcohol-related fatalities. And that don't count the distracted driving or the drug-involved accident. All of you are about to embark on one of the most important sectors of your life. Some of you will be going into the workforce. Some of you will be going to a technical college to learn a trade, others will be going on to the universities to further your education. We want you to stay alive, we want you to be safe, and we want you to be 100%. I'm not up for the tea, not to drink and drive, because guess what? All you are in high school, all you should know better. I'm up here to tell you what, um, what could happen to you if you do drink and drive? Look, let me show you something. You see this right here? This is a consequence of my action 14 years ago. I will always have this. See this right here? This brace is a pain in the butt. And I'll tell you, I will always have to have it. So if I could just, if I could take it back that night, I promise you, I would do it. But I just want all y'all to realize that every choice that you make has its consequence. <laughs> 